R&D is one of the key functions in which the science and the business of, of pharma intersect. Do you feel its work is accurately communicated throughout the organization? And what are your, I suppose, your internal communication strategies? Well, communications is, uh, has got to be one of the number one challenges of, of, of any large organization. And I, and I think there are really um, at least um, three separate communications issues. One is a communication uh, across R&D itself. The second area of communication is, is, is perhaps even even more critical if we're to make if we're to transform the industry and that's to communicate the 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 needs of late phase development into early phase and to merge the problems that late phase will encounter in the clinic into the early development decision making and that really leads down to the third big communications problem making drugs is uh, is fundamentally a very complex scientific effort. We need to get away from the notion that uh, every drug hitting the same target is equivalent. It's really about making science the core of drug development and being transparent about how the information is used through the process. And can you outline to me how you intend to actively promote this course of communication throughout the organization? One key element that GSK has taken on is to try to create working teams that are small enough to speak together, that are co-located, uh, and that have a limited agenda, uh, allowing issues to really be aired fully and, and uh, openly amongst uh, larger segments of the group. It's not a solved problem. It has to be addressed at multiple levels, using multiple different approaches. Um, but I want to go back and emphasize that one of the things that we're trying to grasp is ways of making person-to-person -person contact really be at the foundation of this, because that's ultimately what's so much, more, so much the most effective. For more fantastic interviews directly related to your business, be sure to explore Meet the Boss TV.